Okay, this is a short and sweet video to show you how I make beautiful, oil-free, crispy potatoes. So I'm using Mary Piper potato, I've got these in Tesco's, and this is a one and a half kilogram bag. So I soak them for about five minutes and then I give them a really good scrub with a vegetable brush. I've linked these down, these vegetable brushes down below if you're interested in getting yourself one. They're really handy for doing all sorts of vegetables. So you can leave the skins on, you get more nutrition that way. And then I like to pre-steam the potatoes. So bringing my steamer up to the boil, add all of those potatoes in there. If they're relatively small, like these ones, then I'll just put them in whole. Then I've left the larger ones to kind of do as a second batch, which I would cut in half. So after they have been steaming for about 10 minutes, I let them cool slightly, just so that you don't burn your fingers. Uh, and then I just start chopping these into halves, quarters, chips, whatever I fancy making that day. Sometimes I do really tiny ones as well, just like the really, really small potatoes are really nice as well. So start to just chop them up into whatever size you want and then add them to a bowl. And once the bowl's about half full, I will start to season it. So I always use smoked paprika, onion powder, garlic powder, and then this day I'm using some Cajun seasoning as well, which is optional. Sometimes I use turmeric, sometimes I'll use curry powder, but give them a really good season. And then I'll do the second half, or sometimes do it in three batches, or however many I'm doing. Just do them in smaller batches so that the seasoning can really coat around all of the potatoes and you've got enough space in your bowl to give them a really good mix. So again, adding all of those seasonings in, give them a mix through and add them onto a baking sheet. And I'm using a silicone baking mat here. These again, link down below, they are so good. You just wash them, they're very easy to clean. Then I added salt and pepper as well. Optional, of course, you don't have to have salt. And those go into the oven. I've cooked them as 200 degrees, which is 400 Fahrenheit. About 40 minutes later, and look at the crispiness of these potatoes. So, so, so good. And the reason that I pre-steam them is just to help to keep a bit more moisture inside. I find that it does help them, especially if you're leaving them bigger. It definitely does make a difference to have that extra moisture inside. It works every time and the seasonings really help to crisp them up as well. Lots more videos on my channel about oil-free, healthy cooking. I hope you enjoyed.